everyone, I'm Nate. And I'm Abby. We're the RC Sailors, and we're trying to mix it up a little bit. I know we've had a lot of drones on the channel lately. I wanted to bring some ground vehicles to you. So we found a 1 scale little RC buggy. This is by a company called Zenle Hong. <laughs> it's linked in the description box below. This buggy comes in around $50 to $60. And before we drive it, we're gonna take a quick look and see what comes in the box. Then we'll test it out for you and let you know if it's worth your hard earned money. We're cheating here a bit. I've already taken the body clips off. We've got some of the insides of it already sitting out just so I can show you this. I have to do this anyway, so I figured I might as well show you. Now here is the battery and it's got a very large battery tray inside, meaning that you could probably almost triple the milliamp size and get a much longer runtime. I do like that you have the option of having a bigger battery, but then again, the school of thought could be, why didn't you just put a bigger battery in it, Zin Li Hong? <laughs> uh, anyway, this is a two cell 7.4 volt, 500 milliamp lithium ion, not lipo, so a little bit different there. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and turn our transmitter on and I'll show you a shot of that in just a second because uh, now it doesn't turn on when you plug the battery in but the on off switch is only accessible under this panel which it's already on it's not labeled uh, let's tuck this wire in and this is the little panel thing that I was talking about I don't know why they put the on off switch under here Abby was mentioning that earlier to me I feel like it would have been a better design to have it outside of that panel because you have to take everything apart. It's, it's like it's just pointless to have an on-off switch, honestly. So I do like that system other than that. The switch should be on the outside in my opinion. And you get a cool little wrench to tighten your little wheel nuts up here, which will snug them up. I already did. Oh, well, it needed a little bit more, oh. so you didn't do, didn't do very good. <laughs> Let's give him a little snug. Uh, one, the one was a little loose. Yeah. Oh, you did good. And then we put the little body on here. This is 2.4 gigahertz and only two wheel drive. So we should get a little bit of speed out of this. I hope. Uh, it does look okay. There are four independent shocks on each tire and uh, they are not oil filled. If they are, it's going to just drip out of there really fast because they're plastic shocks. Now you get a little Phillips screwdriver and that's because the little spoiler on the back here doesn't come installed and then you get the included USB charger with a very very unique proprietary type of battery clip connector on there. Same same on the car, I don't like that. And then your spare screws, it comes with two spare screws, spare body clips to hold the body on, uh, instructions and then the transmitter the transmitter most of the time when you have this ability to take this off of your transmitter it's reversible but the trim is on this side so that's kind of pointless that they did this it's it's a very cheap little setup um, I don't know that this is going to be awesome but we still like to feature things on the channel because you never know uh, you never know with this stuff so let's just go ahead and drive it it's rear wheel drive it is proportional, so it's not all or nothing with proportional steering and throttle. Uh, so let's jump right to it. Popeye, what happened to you? <laughs> Popeye, what happened? Test it on the gravel first, then we'll go out on the road and probably get eaten by that big dog. All right, there's full throttle. So it's a little wimpy, which I'm not surprised. And it's hard to steer in this gravel really really hard to control the dog was looking at it <laughs> this is a this is not anything awesome by any means that's full throttle and if i go slower i can manage it in the gravel but to be honest this feels like a. I mean there's not even any there's not even any rubber on my steering wheel or foam or anything oh well, let me try it. okay oh i mean Oh, it is hard to steer with my gloves. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> dog. Are you just going for the dog? I think so. What? She didn't want to drive it. She just wanted to torment the dog. He may kill us. I don't know whose dog this is. No, which is very unsafe to do. I'm not sure why you're I'm not sure why you're doing that. He's just gonna eat it and run away with it. Which, you know, to be honest, I'm kind of okay with. Okay, you're 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 a little 
Oh, oh, he's just a nice little dog. Oh, I'm sorry, doggy. Oh. <laughs> okay, he's fine. He Come back. Like no. <laughs> he was sad. He's like, I don't want to play with that. I don't want to. All right, here comes the car. Yeah, Whoa. drive it. <laughs> I did not do that. Oh my gosh. Okay, so drive it back like slow, and then well, then let's take it on. You want to take it over to the track? See how it does on the track? Can't do anything on the track. Well, let's we show them have... the track. Let's show them our track our here at the airfield. Track. Now, listen, you 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 know, fifty dollars for this. Compare it to other fifty dollar things we've had on the channel. We've had better. We've had way better. We're gonna drive it around and have a little fun with it, Woo but oh, it ramped a little bit. <laughs> it's pretty wimpy. That's full throttle. I know it is right there. Mr. Dog looks pretty. He looks like he's looking he for sad. someone. Or something. What's wrong, Poochie? What's wrong? Don't eat us. Don't eat us, please. Whoa! You missed it. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm focused on the dog that's big enough to eat us. We need a dog like that. Mm -hmm. I'll probably have a good time with it. Alright, here we go. Feels okay in the grass, right? Oh, not that grass. You've got the grass tangled up in the wheels. Oh, shucks. Here we go. There's our speed track. We need a little work done out here. Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh. Full throttle, baby. It is. Oh, this is sad. <laughs> they can't all be wins, guys. If they were, what would be the point in watching our channel? We actually point out the good and the bad stuff, and we're not afraid to, okay. to tell you. This is definitely something for Asper. Okay, let's do it. Let's take it to the road. Here we go. Abby says it's meant for the road. So it's doing okay on the road. All right, bring it back. You're too far away. It's too small. One twelfth scale, a brushed system, plastic everything, full speed right there. I'm not sure who would actually want this over some of the other things we've featured on the channel in this price point. We do our very best to try and find hidden gems, guys. We are thinking about featuring some cool Traxxas stuff on the channel soon. We get asked that all the time, but it's more fun for us to find a mystery car that is fun and half the price of Traxxas stuff. Oh, man. I think that we can pretty well wrap this up and tell you that it is a pass. But if you could find it for maybe about $30, maybe. I would say it's worth it. Maybe $30, yeah. But currently it's about $53. I'm sure with the promo code we could knock it down five or six bucks, but still not worth it in my opinion. I'd rather have a battery for something else we featured on the channel or like that WL Toys green and black truck that we've had and everybody loves. All right, give us a thumbs up for saving you some money. And if you're new to the channel, be sure to, that was cool, subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you can stay up to date with our most current releases and getting the most accurate prices and everything in or out of stock. Now you're making it look cool. Look at you go. <laughs> Thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you guys in the next ditch video. Ditch. See, it's in the ditch. See, right there. Bye.